Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So right off the bat before I start my Sephora and drugstore haul that I'm super excited for with all these goodies because I'm always excited for my hauls. Um, I just want to apologize for Monday's video, how late it went up and how that I didn't put any of the links uh, to the products that I talked about. Normally I have all my videos pre-filmed and all the information is ready to go and everything is scheduled so then I don't have to worry about that week because it's all done. But unfortunately on Sunday um, I had every notion to finish that Monday video up like all that information on Sunday itself. Um, but Sunday evening, myself and my mother and my oldest daughter, we went on the St. John's Haunted Hike that happens here downtown, which is totally awesome. It runs, I do believe, from May, I think, to September the 15th, which is tomorrow. So tomorrow is the last evening for it. It starts at quarter to 10 and ends at quarter to 11. Um, anyways, you go around downtown and they tell you stories that happened back in the 1800s and 1900s, which is so amazing. Anyhow, on the way back to the church, which was the starting point, there by the Saga Rock is the roadway and there was like a little tiny dip that I didn't see. And I was more concerned about Brooklyn tripping up and I wasn't paying no attention to where I was walking. And yeah, I was the one that tripped up in the little tiny hole in the road. And I went forward, I busted up two of my knees I was on the pavement and my knees were like just on fire. So I had to stand up just to stop that pain because it was just unreal. And when I stood up, I was holding on to my mother and I said, I feel really lightheaded. And with that, I don't remember anything else until I came to, I blacked out. My mother said it was like slow motion. I'm standing up and I just kind of went like this and kind of bended. So when I bended, I landed on my bum and then I went back, but they weren't sure if I hit my head off the roadway. But luckily I had my good old Betsy Johnson backpack on that kind of saved my fall, like saved my head before I hit the pavement because that hit the pavement first. Um, but when I came to, I thought I was still standing. I had no notion of anything. So I was rushed to the hospital. They did put a neck brace on my neck. Um, they took tons of x-rays, they did an EKG, and when they did an EKG at 10 o'clock at night, they noticed that my heart rate was irregular, so they're like, okay, maybe that's just the adrenaline and everything that's happening, and you know, you're panicking because this neck brace was so tight to my head, uh, to my neck and to the back of my head, that when I swallowed, I could literally feel my lungs hitting off the neck brace. It was really intense, and anyhow, but when they checked my, when they did another EKG on me, Again, at three o'clock in the morning, my heart rate was still irregular, so I don't know what's going on there. I have a doctor's appointment coming up that I have to do another EKG to see if there's anything going on because normally I'm a healthy person, never had any issues before. So I do apologize for not putting in any of the links to the products that I talked about in Monday's video. Um, and uh, yeah, I will keep you guys up to date and I love you guys. So I'm going to start talking about the items that I purchased from Sephora. Super excited about it. Um, their Saturday that just passed was the VIP Rouge event. So they open up the store at 8.30 and you get to go in and see all the little Christmas goodies. And of course my main goal was to go right to Too Faced. Like I was like, ding, like I just had to go there. Because last year I bought the Christmas set that was exclusive at Sephora. And this year I purchased another one which is called Christmas in New York. And this is the Chocolate Shop and it's coconut powder infused. I love the boxes, they're so smooth, so beautiful. And I will show you what I came with. And here is the box that holds all the goodies inside. And look at this, such cute detail with the bow and the bells. And you open it up. Let's get it all situated here. You open it up and here it is here. And of course you get my all time favorite shadow insurance, a shadow primer, and you get the Better Than Sex Mascara, and then you get a lippy, which I do believe, I'm gonna tell you the shade right now, it's Chocolate Milkshake. And of course they're all mini sizes, which is great for traveling because like who really wants to take a lot of full size products? So much easier to take little mini products. And here is the palette itself. And here we go, and such cute little detail. And here are all your shadows and your highlights and your blushes 
and your bronzer. So in love with this. I'm totally like in love with, it's called Mint, Mint Chip Jingle Berry, which is a beautiful purple tone right here. These shades are just gorgeous. Um, if you guys want to see a look with this palette, let me know in the comments down below. And if you would also like to see swatches, I will definitely do them for you. So in the event, um, of course, you get this little case and it comes with a whole bunch of goodies in here. I got a mascara, some face products, creams, I do believe. I got a little mini size Kat Von D tattoo liner in Trooper, which I totally love. And I also got the Sephora, this is the Waterproof Eye Makeup Remover, which I've never tried before, so I'm curious to try that. And that is all that I purchased from that event. Now, what I purchased when I was in there probably a week or two before that. Now I talked about this in my Monday's video, but I really didn't go into a whole lot of detail with this kit. And this is the Soft and Natural Brow Kit by Benefit. It was $44 plus tax. And normally the Goof Proof, like I said in Monday's video, was like $30. And so I was like, you know what, I'm getting this because this is a deadly deal. So, and I got number three. So here is the Goof Proof, and then you get the eyebrow gel and then you get the brow highlighter pencil and then you get these little stencils with this little stencil holder whoops <laughs> which i really don't know how well it'll work i'm going to put it to the test and see but like i said it was 44 dollars plus tax so it was a deadly deal on that and i'm in the shade number three and I did get my birthday gift, which is the Marc Jacobs birthday gift, and it comes with the uh, lipstick and eyeliner. And I did do an online order. I did this roughly around, well, next week will be roughly around three weeks ago, next week. And I did go online to see if it was still online, but unfortunately it's not there. Um, a couple of days ago or so when I went online it was there so now it's gone again so hopefully fingers crossed it will be back online again and this is called the Sephora Favorites Skin Wonderland and look at all the goodies that you get this is the product that I said about in Monday's video that I will be trying out for a total of three weeks next week and I'm going to give you my honest opinion on all these products in here you can buy these products full size these are all like little sample sizes I was really excited to use the Josie Marin whipped Aragon oil like little mask cream right here and I totally love the smell of it I'm not gonna go into any more details about it because I will be telling you all about it on Monday but all these products are in here. So like I said, you can buy them full size. This kit I do believe was like 80, 80 plus dollars. So I thought that was a really good deal for everything that came in the kit. And I also ordered with my 500 points and this is the Makeup Forever Dare to Be Bold set. And you get a lipstick, an eyeliner, a mascara, a lip gloss, and an eyeshadow. So I thought that was great for 500 points. And I also picked up the Sephora Coconut Water Cleansing Wipes. They were $10, which is deadly. I purchased this up in the VIB Rouge event. Now, let's go on to Drugstore, which I'm super excited for because I love Drugstore products. They are just like deadly. So I did purchase two um, Milani lipsticks and I had to double check that I didn't have them and I didn't. And I got number 62, which is a matte and it's called Blissful. I am so in love with Milani. Like they just, they're so, they just smell so great. I just love them so much. They are like one of my favorite drugstore products besides NYX. And I also picked up number 70, which is a matte and it's fearless. And I thought that this shade would be so beautiful for the fall. It's that really deep, gorgeous, like berry shade. Just so, so pretty. And once again, they smell delicious. And I picked up two Essence products because I'm just in like the whole fall mood and the brown tones. And I picked up two eyeshadows. And this shade here is number 21 and it's called Keep Calm and Berry On, which I thought was super cute. And it's such a beautiful, beautiful color. Now, I don't know how many, how many times I will have to swatch it to get that really beautiful 
swatch because you have to keep on reapplying. But there it is there. So that was like, I think I did like four or five swatches in order to get that much of a pigmentation in that. But very nice. I will put them to the test and see how they go on my lids. And then the next color that I got, which is number 16, it's called Triple Chalk. And this is a beautiful brown shade. And once again, you're gonna really swatch it to build it up. So there it is right there. I mean, they're only, they're not very expensive, so it's not like you're getting really high quality, but for the price and for drugstore, I do like Essence a lot. And I will let you guys know how they perform. Then I also went and got two Wet n Wild products. Actually, that's a lie. I got three Wet n Wild products. And I got the contour palettes. And this one here, I can't even pronounce, but it's the darker shade. And it's number 749A, and they are cruelty free. And then this one I can pronounce, which is Caramel Toffee. And this number is number 750. So I'm really excited to use these contour kits because I've heard so many people talk about them and saying how great they are. You can purchase them at Walmart, so that should be great. And one of their lipsticks, because I love Wet n Wild lipsticks, and this one's called Mocha Licious, which I thought was a super cute name. And it's this beautiful brown shade. Of course, they never had no testers, so let's see how pretty this is. Oh my goodness, it's almost like a like a nudie kind of brown shade, I would say. Like it has like a nude look to it. So nude brown. So beautiful. And the prices are already always, always great with them. And I picked up an e.l.f. contouring brush. Uh, I picked this one up at Walmart. This was like $7 and change. So I'm really curious to see how this works, if it has a nice feel to it. Um, very soft, not dense at all. So that's super exciting. And I totally love the sleek look to it. So beautiful. And keeping to going with the theme of e.l.f., I did pick up the lip primer and plumper. Um, I'm not really sure. I opened this uh, when I got home and I just wanted to see what it looked like. So here's the nice packaging. And so here is the primer right here. And here is the plumper formula right here. Now this smells like those, you know those like hot peppermint candies that you get, like the little red hearts, or even those red um, peppermint uh, lips. That's what it smells like. So I'm not a fan of peppermint, so I don't know about that. We'll, we'll try it on the lips and see, see how that one goes. So that's it. I really hope that you guys enjoyed my Sephora slash drugstore haul. Let me know if you guys like my hauls and leave it in the comments down below if you guys have tried any of these products that I mentioned in today's video. Don't forget to check out the giveaway that I am hosting. It does end on September 21st. All the information will be down in the link below. And thanks so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Till next time, my friends. Much love to you all. Bye.